you're tired of spending a lot of time with repetitive tasks in your notion so i know if you are a content creator or if you have a business owner especially if you have a part-time job or full-time job like i did when i started my business every time is precious so you don't want to spend a lot of time just you know creating repetitive tasks so today i'm going to show you how i use notion buttons and how i use uh, self-generating days in notion i basically create a template that i know i'm going to use it every day with everything that i need so i don't need to keep looking for things and it's very tailored for taking action you know, on that specific thing in each day. So I don't feel super overwhelmed with all the things that I have to do. And let's go. So I'm going to show you how I use it into my organized brain. Template. This is my organized brain template is my main dashboard is the page that I use basically every day. So at the top of it, I have my um, habit tracker. So I have like buttons to make sure I check things quickly. So I don't have to check one at a time. Um, and this is what I want to show you. Uh, I have a lot of things going on here. Um, and this template is tailored for, my, for myself. So that doesn't mean they have to do exactly the same, but I'm going to show you how I use it. So I have this daily plan template is a page. So if you go on the three dots and click on edit, you can edit the template and customize with your own things. So with all the things that you need to plan your day. So what I like to have is um, this call out. So I know what I want to get done that day and my daily affirmation. These are just random to do's that come up throughout the day. So if a task comes up and I don't know when I want to finish, I don't know when I want to do so, I can just drag them to my database. And this is my main agenda database that is linked in here. Um, so I can only see tasks that are due today. So because I added a filter where the date is this day, it's not gonna show all the other tasks that I have in my agenda. Is only going to show these ones. And I also have like um, emoji just to, set the priority for each task so i know which one is more important and i can even sort that this way so i i keep the red on top at the moment that's how it looks uh, this is a simple database um as let me show you here is a table database that i added a time uh, this is a select property no i is not a select property is a multi select property that I created with all the times and as you can see here the blue ones are the ones that I am actively working and I create my routine here so I don't have to type everything all the things that I do so basically like that's my plan, that's my ideal day. Uh, I wake up at five, I do some meditation, some journaling, some reading, and I go to CrossFit seven o'clock. Uh, when I come back, I have breakfast, I get ready and I start working because I work from home now. I'm working full time on my business, finally. Um, so I have like more control and more flexibility. So I have uh, all the other tasks that I want to get done on this space. So what I normally do is I do a deep work session. So if I'm recording videos, I'm going to do just one thing in this big block of work. And so I have some lunch. So what I did here, I just added the tasks that I know they are very unlikely to change. And I leave the other ones in black. Um, I don't feel them. So when I'm going to plan my day, I add them. And this is just a reflection uh, section. And once I have this template ready, 
um, you can create whatever you want in your own page. Once you have it ready, you close the page and let's say I'll click on the day here and I click on this um, new daily plan. So it's going to open up this new page with all the things that I just updated. So all I have to do is just do the things that I need to get done. And I also do my uh, checklists and I fill out all the things that I need to get done. So let's say I want to do like record videos. So I like to do like time blocking. So I use these blocks to videos and that's basically it. So if you want to create your own page, you all you need to do is just to come here, new template, daily plan. Um, so I even have this property, uh, this idea I got from Marie Pauline. He, she's a Notion creator as well. And I love this idea to have like themes uh, of things to work in a day. Instead of like doing all the things I work, I'm a solopreneur. I don't have anyone to help me. So I like to set days also this day is going to be admin day this day is going to be a day to work on my 12 week year goals or content creation for example so i'm just going to create one uh, self-generating day for content creation content creation day and what I can do here, instead of creating everything from scratch, if you already have it on your Notion, is you can go back into this um, template that you already have. And we're going to copy. And we are going to paste in here. And let's just make sure this is connected. Yeah, this is the database are connected. And yeah, so I know exactly what that day is going to be focused on daily creation. So you can add more things. You can, I can even like add here content creation day. and uh, schedule, so like schedule posts, and this is it. So make sure you add an icon. And the template is going to be here. So what if you want to make these um, into a button? Let me show you how you can create a button for that. Because now in Notion you can do this. So let's create a button. All right, so let's say new daily plan. Let's add an icon here. So because I have the black icons, I'm just going to add uh, the black icons here as well. So into the new steps, uh, you click on here, add a step, and we are going to add a page to my today's agenda, which is this database that we were just uh, creating the template for it. So here, when you, you, we are going to create a new page into this database. So you can select the templates that you already have. So let's use the daily plan as an example. And so this is going to add this page and then you need to add a new block um, to open the page, the new page added. So once this button is ready, let's just try and see if it's working. So as you can see, it creates the daily plan um, for you immediately. And you can just set the date. You can set a theme if you want to. And then 
is going to be here. So that's a way to automate. Um, but there is also another way that you can create recurring tasks. And I don't know any better way to do this than in the way that I'm going to show you. So if you want to automate this um, daily plan, you can come here and set as repeat every day. So it's going to repeat every day, set the time that you want to repeat and save. So yeah, this is going to repeat every day, but what happens is it's not going to show up in your calendar. Uh, what you need to do to show up in the calendar, if you want to, you need to create another view, another calendar view, and you need a created time property, which you can get it in here. So if you go to new property, add a created time property and don't do anything with it. And tomorrow, when you come back here, you see a new daily plan in here. But I don't, I don't personally use this because I don't like to have like multiple views. I only like, I like, this one is my favorite, to be honest. I like to see my entire week. And if I don't want to see the entire week, I like to use this daily plan where I can see only the tasks that I have for the day. And that's basically it. Um, so this is my organized brain template. I am creating a new version of it, a more updated version. And I'm going to be launching on my Notion shop. So if you want to get this new version for 2024 make sure you are on my newsletter the freedom club hub i only send one email a week every tuesday i send an email with three things that you should know about i always talk about like passive income uh notion tips and productivity tips for creators so if you want to join uh, I'll leave the link in my bio and I'll be releasing a new organized brain very soon. So you can get access to it, to all these pages. And I am creating a very special offer for everyone that gets uh, the new organized brain template because this template literally saves my life. I would not be able to grow a business by myself and create courses and create multiple projects without a system like this. And if you don't know how to create your own system, I'll leave the link below so you can join my newsletter and so we stay connected. If you found this video useful, please leave a like below because this helps my channel to grow and help more people just like you and I will be sharing the new version of the new Organized Brain very soon. All you have to do is just to get the link in my description so you get access to my Freedom Club newsletter and I'll be sharing with you whenever this template is ready. Okay, so you can start the year well and very organized and with a system that works. Um, so yeah, I hope I see you on the next one. Bye.